Hello! We're playing games. <laughs> Hi, babe. We're playing Call of Carrot. I'm just gonna start because why not? Also, I hope this game's not too loud. It, it doesn't have a volume. That's not very nice. Oh, yeah. Don't let the octopus into your home. That's our message from our lovely sponsor, Hurston Enterprises. Before you get any ideas about sea life on the run, the octopus represents those bastard okay, zombies okay. on board. It's a metaphor, you see. I tell ya, I love being up at 6 a.m. on a Monday. The sun rising over the city reminds me of all the life down there. All those good, stout-hearted Americans with jobs in their minds and capitalism in their hearts. I can't open that, that, that. Nope. Okay. We've got a special guest I'm interviewing today, Joanne. Hello, Charles. I'm excited to be here. Now, We're gonna what's make a some good eggies. Christian woman like you doing out of the kitchen and on America's airwaves? I want to do that myself sometimes, Charles. Um. Heh. <laughs> Where's my, like, pots and pans and shit? Aha! I don't like the octopus people near home, but the tentacles are so nice. Oh my god. Calvert, Calvert, what the fuck are you doing? He just crawled up to me. Uh... I'm cooking egg. And then two strip of bacon. I didn't know this was a cooking sim. <laughs> a bit of salt. And a dash of pepper. That's a lot of fucking salt, Jesus. And that's a lot of pepper. It's also a lot of salt, Jesus Christ. Take a fork to it. Got. Got it. Got it. Francis, I made your favorite. Meatloaf sandwich Mom, with- Mom, I can't talk. I gotta go now. I'm gonna miss the bus. Oh, okay. Well, I love you. Are you tired of feeling taken for granted? You know it, Charles. Of course you are. We know all you family men work hard um, today just to provide for the kiddos at the old ball and chain. And when I saw that. What was wrong with my table? Hmm. Honey, I'll be out late again. Have dinner ready when I get back. Got it. I'm like an 80s housewife. Yes, this truly is the American dream. Happy home, happy life, and happy wife. And what could be happy? We'll be back with more tales from all around the greatest country on earth after these messages. Oh. Okay. Fuck you, kid. Francis is a bitch. There. Clean up. Uh. Uh. Oh. Huh? It might be time to lay off the morning wine. Ugh. Even when something's a little different around here, there's always a mess to clean up. No, put, pick it up. Put it on the table. Pick it up! Put it on the table!
ねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねえねはい。おお。ああ、もう少し、ignore that。ペンシルのテーブル。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。Definitely a book. Okay. It's it's definitely a book. Just gonna get good enough. So, hey, fuck. What? Okay. That counts as on the shelf. So, oh, put that down. Did it. It's not hurting me, so I'm ignoring it. Um, cups, plates, forks. Cups. How many, though? Plates. Bake the meatloaf? Okay. That's how you cook things, right? Oh, is this the wrong table? Oh, okay, okay. This table! Got it! Why did I have two tables? That's confusing. Only four? Okay. I heard something. What's spookified? We're just gonna ignore it. Slice it up. Why does it have words in it? Dinner's ready. Sure. 
Sure. When Francis isn't sorting uh -huh. his trading cards and John isn't working on his novel, dinner can't come fast enough. But when they're busy, they can't be bothered. Ugh, well, I can might as well throw them all the radio out. While I wait. And what a wonderful day it was! And if we have our way, we'll be living like this forever. Don't forget, anyone who wants different is a threat to our country. Be sure to report any strange happenings to... Oh, I didn't mean to go outside. Okay. Okay, we're cooking more breakfast. Um... Excuse me. I need you to not do that. What? <sighs> if I have to politely remind John to stop stacking food against the fridge door again, I'll scream. Or, I would. If he didn't always leave the room when I show womanly emotions. Floor bacon for me. Oh, what a feeling. Good morning, America. We're back at it again on this bright and sunny morning. And aren't we glad that it's bright and sunny, considering that freak storm over the Atlantic last night? That certainly didn't give me any ideas about the fragility of our human lives. In other news, does the amount of salt you put on your meatloaf say something about how good of a wife you are? Tune in after the break to find out. I expected all like the salt and stuff to fucking fly out. I have to pick this up. I don't wanna. Francis, don't forget your lunch. Next time, can you make lunch like Timmy's mom does? She gives him cookies. And don't you forget the meatloaf tonight, honey. I. <sighs> I never do. I'm Karen. Today's broadcast brought to you by Austin Enterprises' new vacuum cleaner with brand new technology that keeps vacuum your house crime. cleaner longer. But not too long, or you ladies back home would have nothing to do. We've got a testimonial today from one of our happy customers. Say hello to America, Susan Jones. Hi, Charles. It's a pleasure to be here. Susan Jones? Timmy's mom, PTA president, makes snide comments about my brownies. Now, Susan. You're a mother, exactly. PTA president, and baker extraordinaire. Oh, I don't know if I'd say extraordinaire. I just know what I'm doing when some others <laughs> struggle. Hey. Susan Jones? Timmy's mom. All right. That's definitely not normal. Now, Susan, you're a mother, PTA president, and baker extraordinaire. Oh, I don't know if I'd say Any second now, air. Charles from PSL Radio is going doing. to knock on when the door and tell me this is all a weird <laughs> prank show segment. A bit more. And Susan will- Sure, Susan. It's fine, everything's fine. No. It's fine. Uh, we need more and more cup. Uh, and then we need to slice it up. Where's my knives? Why does that make it look so weird? Um, where's my my knives? Ah, I found a knife. Dinner's ready. In a minute. In a minute. Ugh. Well, that's it for me tonight, folks. Keep an eye out for anything strange, and don't forget. <laughs> There's so much strange. Cook to eggy. Got it. Not again. It's fine. Well, I prefer floating bacon to floor bacon. Though I can't say I'm a huge fan of either. Another day in American paradise. The greatest country on earth. Don't forget. 
Everything's completely fine. Today's program is brought to you by... And that's not all. If you buy now, you'll get a free pair of binoculars to spy on your neighbors. Eh. Everything's fine. He said it. everything's fine. Okay, get... Get back here. Where'd my bacon go? It's fine. Eh. Eh. We need salt and pepper. I hear your spooky sounds. Keep them to yourself. Bye, Did Francis. It. Hope you have a good day at school. Have a good day at work, dear. Lovely. Vacuum the grime, got it. Where's the grime? Oh, oh. I threw the vacuum, I didn't mean to. Buy a Hurston vacuum, he said. It will have your carpet sparkling like new. Yeah, yeah, give me a ring when it does the same thing for my ceiling. We're just gonna pretend this is normal. Oh yes, Being Magazine is here. Please take me away to a world of country melodrama where I don't have to worry about how my house might be possessed. Mail order silver bullets. Right click to hold for sure. Write your information and then drop the envelope in the envelope to take it to the mail slot. Silver bullets, huh? You know what? Sure. Better safe than sorry. If only I hadn't sold the pistol when they had Francis. Okay, I'm ordering silver bullets. Oh. Those silver bullets can't get here fast enough. Hey, whatever entity is doing this, please stop. I don't need any more cleaning to do. Really? Oh. Okay, okay, I can take a hint. Enough. Okay, friend. Need more cups? It's fine. need a knife. <laughs> Dinner's ready. In a minute. In a minute. I should start cooking for the entity in the house. Maybe it will appreciate my cooking. Cool. I can't tell if that's a yes or a no. 
going to say no. Good evening, listeners. Gee, did that day fly by with no strange happenings at all. For you night owls out there, here's the evening news. That storm out by the Atlantic seems to have cleared up. The Navy is setting out to investigate, to make sure it isn't something... else. Meanwhile, some odd fellow in Johansson County swears there's a new mountain on the horizon by his house. <laughs> oh, That's the strange. Things some folks will do for attention, am I right? If you live near that man, you'd best keep an eye on him for other unusual behavior. It's fine. Everything's fine. Good morning, everyone. Every day is a clean slate, a brand new start. Breakfast, as you all know, is the most important meal of the day. Except, of course, for the most important meal of the universe, where the old ones descend upon humanity and eat the sun. Broadcast is telling me that isn't a standard meal in most American households. My mistake. Bake bacon. Bacon. Egg. Oh shit. Egg. I hear your spooky shit. I'm cooking breakfast. Are you there? Yeah, Timmy's dad is driving me to school. Fuck Timmy's dad. Oh, I can drive Timmy's you. Timmy's mom says that woman shouldn't drive. Bye, honey. I feel bad. Strange. My silver bullet shouldn't arrive until tomorrow. Oh boy. From Susan. What did she have to say this time? I it's saw a... your lawn was looking more drab than usual, oh. and I thought, there's a gal who has eldritch demons in her home. Here's a book that might help. Wow, isn't that just so thoughtful of her? I've chained up it up so the unspeakable power won't escape, but you should be able to use it while it's closed. I can vacuum up the the grime. My vacuum is magical now. Ain't no demons in my home. It's fine. Okay. That's actually useful. Oh, I have to write her a nice thank you letter now, don't I? Uh, throw a pencil at the paper to see what ideas flow. Got it. It means so much to me that you reached out, especially with your extraordinarily busy schedule. I'll be sure to send over some fresh brownies when I get the chance. I'll make them extra overcooked, just for you. Hold it nice if Susan doesn't have something to say about it. Announcement from your local neighborhood watch. Over at your neighbors for dinner, hey. keep an eye out for strange happenings. A dysfunctional hey. dinner is the first sign of an unhappy home and a potential threat to your community. Come on, Charles. I don't need you calling me out, too. My meatloaf is possessed, but we're gonna pretend like I don't know this. That's a knife. Eh. Hey. 
Eh. Okay, now I need the meatloaf. Um. Just. No, I need you to get in the oven. I throw things now. Get in the oven. Get in the oven. I don't like to have eyes, but it's fine. This is a fucking struggle and a half. Maybe some of the holy water from the closet will set it straight. I need to catch it and trap it on the counter first. Ah, oh, okay. Well, you can just fuck around. Oh! Ah, my meatloaf is normal! Also... Karen, what the fuck's up with that closet over there? A knife! Dinner's ready! I'm working on my novel. I'm sorting my trading cards! Are you an unhappy housewife in your house life? Maybe so, Charles. Maybe so. Then stay tuned! We've got ten appliances that will make you the perfect house spouse! And they're so easy, we're sure even you ladies will be able to figure it out! And ten more reasons for Susan to brag about how rich she is at the next PTA meeting. Appliance one! A safe lined with iron to keep the manuscripts describing all the horrors you've seen! Excuse me? And five down is Cthulhu for Tartan Leader! Those are the answers to yesterday's crossword! Hope you had fun playing along with us! Strange words this time. Is it Cthulhu? Is it Darn, I thought it was Cthulhu Patagon Arlie. So close. Cool, we're dealing with Cthulhu. I'm down for that. Egg. Egg. I don't know where my other egg went, so we're just gonna cook another one. It's fine. Give me the bacon! Bacon. Where's my- there's my plate. bacon go? I don't know. Oh, I need salt and pepper. You're right. sure to be safe out there, Francis. There's been strange news lately. I'll be fine, Mom. Timmy's dad is picking me up from school, and Timmy's mom is gonna make me brownies after. Honey, have you noticed anything odd lately? Come to think of it, your meatloaf was a little dry yesterday. 
It's all right. I'll pick up pizza tonight. How thoughtful. Oh, perfect. My bullets are here. Now, I might not have a gun. And most sources say you need a gun to use bullets. Now, this is what I'm talking about. I don't know when I'll need it, but better safe than sorry. Where did I... Oh, I put it on my vacuum. Saw that. Tonight's broadcast is brought to you by The Stars Are Right, your number one guide to the stars being right. Also providing services like seeing if the stars are right and making sure that the ones to send upon the world. Broadcast, okay. what do you mean they're not a sponsor? The stars are right. The, the stars, stars are right. It's right here. The stars are right. The stars are right. The stars are right. No, no, it's fine. I told you, I'm just going to share the joyous news that, that the, the old ones are returning, returning and they're charging their boat to the second city of yeah, and that Calamari is on sale at Gigamart today. 50% off. Oh, we're on air now? Okay. Hello everyone, Calamari is on sale at Gigamart today. Add a bit of extra kick to your morning smoothie with some tasty sea life. Delicious. Actually, that doesn't sound delicious at all. Well anyhow, it's a Saturday. Hey. Time to kick back and relax after a long hard week of work providing for your families. And hey, maybe your wives can take a break too. Egg. 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 Give me the egg. Oh god, this one's hard. Oh god, where did it go? There it is. Uh, I need bacon. My meatloafs are possessed. <laughs> Is it, can it just be any plate? Enough. Did it. Play poker with the guys. I'll be back late. Timmy found a weird bat lizard by the creek. We're gonna go poke it with a stick. Hey, don't. Susan should pay more attention to her kid. Yeah. Hello? Oh. Grab the vacuum and fire away. Got it. This, this has gone on long enough. Yeah, I'm talking to you. I'm sick of all this. It's hard enough to do all the work around here, and I don't need you making it worse for me. I'm stuck. I cannot. I've spent my whole life cleaning up other people's messes, and I'm not dealing with yours, too. I'm ending this once and for all. Heck you, Cthulhu. 
vacuum seal between the closet? There's no seal in the closet. Seal vacuum in closet. Oh. Take it outside. I'm just gonna shoot him between the eyes, I guess. A housewife defeated Cthulhu. A beautiful day in American paradise. A lovely country with a lovely radio station host that may have just been put on sick leave for a month because of erratic behavior. Strangely, I feel much better, but I'm not going to turn down a free vacation. In any case, sayonara, America. I'll see you again once I'm done sipping pina coladas in Bermuda. Well, that takes care of that. Yeah. Oh. Well, that's new. Honey, I'm off to work. Oh, and when I get home, I want to talk to you. Frankly, the house has been a mess this week. Susan's mentioned that she's seen all sorts of things through the windows, and you're not really making this a structured environment for Francis. We both know that you need to clean more, but I want to find a solution that works for you. Happy wife, happy life, right? Is that so? Oh. Okay. Lovely. Okay. Well, that was cool. The call of the the call of Karen. I think we're gonna play this one. Called Cursed. I don't know how loud it's gonna be, so just a warning. There are tons of games called Cursed, by the way. I think it's this one, I'm not sure though. Sure, you're a baby. Uh, it's trying to open. My cat's just laying on the floor screaming at me. Hi. Hey, baby. He has come over. My whole computer froze, so I might die. Oh. It's opening. Trying to. Oh. It just, it just 
threw me into the game. No, no warning. Who needs a warning? Oh god. It's fine. Uh... Okay. Hold on, I can't see shit. I gotta go shut my window. That's a little better. I still can't see shit, though, so, uh, we're gonna just be blind for this. Hello? I don't even have a flashlight. Nothing? Oh, oh, oh! I got a flashlight. Cool. What are we doing? Hello? Hold on, the bow sensitivity. That's a little better. Hello? I don't know what I'm doing here. There was no backstory. It just threw me in a game. I'm making my way downtown. Fuck. Getting fast somehow. About. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Is anybody home? Or am I just breaking in? Because, like, if that's what I'm doing, I guess I'm down. But, like, I don't know. Hello? Oh, there's, there's like... A bunch of beds in here. Bye. I haven't been able to click on anything yet. So I feel like this is like an explorer. Anyone out there? No? Okay, I can run. Maybe I need to get outside? I saw like a building in the distance. Kiri, why do you cry? <laughs> um... Outside. Got a whole lot of maze out here. All right. Well, I got out. I don't think that was the way I was supposed to get out. Hi, Caliber. Come on. Spooky maze. Hello. Yeah. 
Big spooky house. Like if I, I found the way I was supposed to leave. Is this like a greenhouse? Going in the greenhouse, fuck you. Greenhouse is spooky. Got it. I feel like that building over there is where I'm supposed to go, but I don't really want to go that way. I saw something in the distance! Hello! Notice me, senpai! A boat! Can I leave? Oh, this is... I died! Uh, and the game just closed. It just... It just said no. And then closed. Excuse me, I want to explore more. Search the house for the Book of Cursed Souls. Okay, that's what I'm doing. It did not tell me before. Hello? I drowned last time, but it's fine. Everything is fine. I also have to eh, readjust because it's a little guy on my lap. She does not understand the meaning of personal space. Come on. Ha! There we go. Let's squish the little dog. He's, he's just a little guy. It's okay. Come here, you're just a little guy. Yeah. Hello? We're searching the house for a book. That may or may not be here. Hello? Oh! B to open the book. Uh, by taking this book I have cursed myself what I once- I had once convinced myself were shadows and my own Im wild Im imaginings I now know to be very real. He, if you can allow yourself to ascribe humanity to the creatures, now pursue me as if some sense of newfound vulnerability. I do not claim to understand the book's readings, but I know he seeks his replacement. He pursues me with malice and desperation in equal measure. My only hope now is to complete the ritual, though I do not see how. The leaf from the bush behind the manor in the hill should be simple as maybe the cross from the church. Oh shit, something's coming after me, I assume. Hello? I was reading. Fuck off. Fuck off in, like, the kindest way. Uh, 
but no by design I can convince I can obtain some of his blood. If I manage to obtain these things, I can perform the ritual in the gazebo by the lake. He will become increasingly violent and hysterical as he sees my plan unfold. I must be swift. Okay, so I need a leaf, a cross, and his blood. I don't know who he is, but I am now terrified. Let's go. Oh! Oh! Hey! Hi, friend! Uh, you're not actually as scary as I thought you'd be. Later. Fucker. Let's not have you trap me in a room, though. Going outside. This is the wrong way outside. <laughs> ah! That sound spooks me more than anything. Okay, we're going this way. We need some kind of leaf. I assume from like the... Oh. Can I just leave? <laughs> leaf me alone, fucker. You Gross. A lot of ground to cover here. I don't appreciate these sounds. Eh, that will sell. I can't get up. Thank you. My light's not working. I got a knife. Ah! Fucker. Ugh. It's fine. Everything's fine. I got a knife. I don't know how to use it, though. the best plan that we have is just leave. Cool, we're gonna follow this dark spooky path. Is... What? How many buildings are on this fucking property? Jesus Christ. Very creepy sound. It sounds like somebody's like tapping on glass. Should I be scared? I feel like I probably should be, but am I? Only a little. Just a little bit. Cool, 
I definitely feel like I'm trapping myself. Going out to the woods. How am I supposed to find anything in this large ass map? That's just a dock. Okay, I can jump, so that's a good thing, I guess. Very weird house. This way. You know, everything's super glitchy. Everything's fine. Hey, baby. Uh, okay, okay. We found ourselves back to the garden, which I assume is... Um... Cool. I don't know what to do. Oh, I got some of his blood, I guess. A leaf from the bush on the manor... Behind the manor on the hill. And then across from the old church. That's a leaf, take it. Go to church? I don't think so. Oh, that's water. It spooked me. Stortled me. Don't walk in the water. We learned this the hard way last time. Is this the gazebo? Hey, that's the church. Hello! I'm here to raid you. There's a ghost guy chasing me, and he's getting angies. Oh, it's a lovely cemetery. Everything's fine. Come on. Your mom's a bitch! Leave me alone! Ooh. 
Leave me alone. I need a leaf now. <laughs> you know, there are many old gazebos around here. How am I supposed to know which one's the right one? Is the one that I, I drowned trying to get to last time? Because I bet it would be. Is this in front of the manor? Behind the manor? I don't even know. I don't have a map. A ladder. I wanna... It, why is there just a whole ass boat here? We're not gonna question it. I mean, I did question it, but like, it's fine. Boy, oh, I didn't mean to do that. I just need a leaf. A leaf. Leaf me alone. This place is so... large. has a light in it so we're gonna go investigate. Oh it's the manor cool now I need to get behind it. I need a leaf. A leaf from a bush upon a hill. That's that's what I apparently need. Are you a bush? No. I can't see shit. And it's fine. I'm looking for a hill. There's just a bunch of boats. Bye. Oh, I thought that was like a person standing there. No, it's just a boat. A rock. Another rock. We've been through this one. It makes a weird... Yeah, that sound. Get it? Leave cross. Oh, cool, it did. And then a gazebo. Across the lake. I didn't think that was actually what I needed, and so now I'm far startled. It's fine, we're good. across the lake. How? Last time I tried, I died. This one? Is it 
Is it this one? That was terrifying. I should grab all the leave by the boat at the dock. What? What clues? Also, it's very pretty now. Like, this doesn't seem scary. What is that? I don't even know. Still have a flashlight. Huh? It said something about clues? You grab the book before leaving. Isn't this the reason that you got cursed in the first place? I'm gonna go see if it's in the same spot as before. Hello? Not. It's not in the same spot. Hi, Kiri. Yeah. He cried because he is baby. Where's this book then? Hello? Not like that's just a little empty room. Hi, Kiri. She touch. He straight up just smacked me. Sorry. But I can't leave, apparently. The book is somewhere in here. And I apparently need to find it. There was nothing there. I just clicked on it to see if it would let me. But now I'm free, so.
You know, my flashlight's being wiggy. Even though it's during the day. Trying to find my way out of here. Hi, Kiri. What about? There's multiple. There's the gazebo that I did the cursey curse on, I believe. Uh, I'm gonna assume that boat. We're gonna head to that boat. And hopefully we don't drown this time. Cause I drowned last time. Allow... Hello. Oh no. Ah! I died. I accept my fate. The game just closed again. Anywho. Um... We're gonna play a game called Black Rose. Cause I said so. Black Rose. And hopefully this one will be fun. Oh. Uh. Okay. Simple and to the point. Got it. That's it. It just it just says start. Uh, attention, this game contains flashing light, quick time events, and jump scares. Lovely. I'm bad at quick time events. Oh, I hate this. Can I... It's so loud. We're just gonna... It's fine. What Mono... I, I don't know what any of these... Say. They are so tiny. Anyhow, um... It's fine. It's fine. Timed mode or story mode? Uh, in this mode, you follow investigation of 
mortician who worked at a funeral home for many years before an unknown disaster killed all the employees. Unlike time mode, this mode focused on the story of Black Rose and therefore is much longer. Your final score will be based on your close calls as you are not being timed. <laughs> Ruth. Uh, this mode features a checkpoint system and remember the previous checkpoint even the game has been closed. Please do not close the game with saving. Okay, I don't know how long this game is. Just, just, just so everyone's aware. Calvert, you're in the way, sir. Oh, just toss me in. That's fine. Hello? Oh. Pain and suffering has warped their bodies. Got it. Hello? Restricted area. Personal only. Got it. Can I open doors? Oh. Okay. I can. That door's locked. I don't want to go upstairs yet. I want to explore. Hello? I want to light a fire. Visitation room. Uh, I guess they were pretty serious about keeping this door shut. I wonder if the keys are around here somewhere. Got it. Find the keys. Is someone else here? You know, that's an appropriate response to hearing someone laugh in the darkness. Boss says not to go near Myrtle's coffin. Why won't the gravedigger bury it anyway? It's not like the boss says it's true. I mean, the dead can't really talk, can they? I have a feeling I don't want to find out. What's this? Corkboard. Yeah. It's jammed. Might not be able to. I might be able to open. Be able to force it open, but I would need to ram it a couple times. Press space. Hold. Cool. I hate this. I'm gonna go back this way. Hello? Hello? No one was in there, okay. Family room. Door is pretty badly, I won't be able to- I don't think I'll be able to get it. Okay, warped pretty badly. Okay, we're gonna go... ...through this door over yonder. Oh... There's a baby monitor here. Strange. I don't think- Why would you pick that up? I don't want to hear what's on the other side of it. That door's locked. Carrie, Carrie, quit touching things. When my cat- No! Who was that? Works pretty bad, I won't be able to get through it. Okay, we're going down here then. Chapel! Locked. Hello? I don't want to. But I'm going to. Hello, friend. Well, oh. 
is not an illusion. Cool, I hate this. Oh. Her eyes don't look her in the eyes. Got it. Baby monitor's down here. This is weird. I'm not sure I want to be here anymore. Something feels wrong. Yeah, you think? It's fine. Everything's fine. No, I'm leaving. Fuck you. No. Throw's gonna slam. No? What's going on? Don't care. Don't... Don't wanna know. Door's locked. I know it wasn't earlier. Ah! Okay, that wasn't as spooky as I wanted it to be, or like, needed. I, I don't know. It wasn't as spooky as I thought it was going to be. It's locked. I know it wasn't earlier. Can't get through that door. No! Game over. Okay. It was like, there's gonna be... Okay, okay, okay. I guess that was it. I mean, there's probably like a way to beat it. But like, I don't, I don't really care. Anywho, I hope everybody enjoyed watching. I will, uh, see you in the next one. Have a good day. Goodbye.